On Friday, the health department recommended that everyone start wearing a mask indoors as the number of COVID cases rises. This just as parents prepare to send their kids back into the classroom. Right now, students and staff at Wichita Public Schools don't have any rules regarding face coverings. Cakes Maeve Ashbrook joins us live now with parents. What they need to know as the school year approaches. Maeve. Deb David, in-person enrollment for the Wichita Public Schools started today, and everyone who got to come out here to McLean Elementary had their choice whether or not they wanted to wear a mask. With all of these new recommendations, though, the district says that they're not sure. It's just too early to tell whether this will change any of their COVID-19 policies for the upcoming school year. It was a short taste of school for Ashley Stegman, soon to be fifth and second graders Monday. It just feels more personal being able to do it like kind of in person versus like doing everything online. In person open enrollment for Wichita Public Schools kicked off, but just as Stegman opted to come in person, she's hoping the experience is echoed here at McLean Elementary throughout the year, even with COVID-19 continuing to spread. The not knowing of when things are going to spike up, if they're going to go back to, you know, doing online stuff. COVID cases in Sedgwick County are on the rise and last week the county health department began recommending everyone wear a mask inside even if you're vaccinated. We've learned uh, that it's best to take your time, get adequate information and then make decisions uh, when it comes closer to the time when you have to make a decision. Wichita Public Schools says it's just too early to decide if that recommendation means it needs to revise its current COVID-19 protocols. Masks are currently optional. We have enough masks for our staff. We have enough, enough masks for our students and they will be made available. That I don't believe will change at all in terms of their availability. For Stegman, masks aren't make it or break it when it comes to the virus. If they need it, they need it. If not, I feel like it's it's easier. Her biggest fear is having to move online, something she knows all too well. I mean, I definitely don't want to see another school shut down. I think being in person is a lot nicer just because you actually you get that human interaction, which is I, I feel like is really important for the kids. And the district did say if there are any changes to those COVID-19 policies, they will come from either the Human Resources Department or Board of Education. As far as enrollment in person goes through Wednesday, families can also enroll online right now and continue to do so once in-person enrollment is over. Live in North Wichita, Maeve Ashbrook, Kick News on your side.